Holy shelf is getting a little crowded up here. So here is our new three chamber soap dispenser. Here it says shampoo, conditioner, and body wash, but it does come with little labels that you can put on whatever you want it to be. Gotta make sure you put the gel douche in there. Now there are a lot of these on Amazon. Uh, the reason I went with this one is because it comes with the ability to just glue it to the wall without having to drill holes into your tile. Because our tile or our shower is all tile and I don't want to drill holes. And what if this breaks in the future and I can't find a replacement? Then I have holes in my tile and I can't do anything about it. So I'd rather glue it to the wall. The package comes with four adhesives and a glue. First we're going to flip this over and you'll notice that there are four sections here, one for each of the four adhesive pads. So we're going to put those in the desired or the designated locations. So in this, the sections with the holes is where you're going to put the glue. Now you can see on this one it has an angled edge, which means you can put this in the corner as well. So you need to decide where in your shower you want to put your dispenser. In my case, I already have a squeegee hung to the wall, so I'm not going to put it in the corner. But if you are going to put it in the corner, make sure you put your adhesive squares on the sides, not in the back like this. I'm going to mount it just right here underneath the shelf. So now that I decided where in the shower I want to, I want it to be flat mounted. Next. Next comes putting on the silicone. Yes, I know my fingers are dry, but that's because I'm working on another project. So we'll undo the cap and that pointy part of the cap, that'll focus, will poke a hole in this part of the um, silicone tube. Pop the hole, and then we're just gonna spread the glue on these sections with the holes. So I've gone ahead and I've squeezed out the silicone. I've gone in an S pattern, which I like to do when using adhesives. Now this isn't too heavy, but you have to remember that you also are gonna have your conditioner, your shampoo and shower gel or whatever you put in the three chambers. So a little bit extra, it's not gonna hurt anybody. It's just gonna be a lot more of a pain to take off later, but like I said, we're not drilling holes in the tile. So you can just use a little spatula and get the glue off. So I'm just gonna put on a decent amount. Before you mount, remember to peel these parts off of your adhesives. Last step is just push it to the wall, wherever you want it to be. In my case, I've got this shelf, so I'm gonna to wanna to make sure that I have room enough to open the lid to pour in whatever I'm going to put in the chambers. Shampoo, conditioner, body gel, whatever. Make sure you put it on decently level so all of the contents can come out correctly. All of your shampoo, conditioner, shower gel will all come out nice and smooth. That's what she said. Going to give it an hour or so for that glue to dry before I put anything in it. Once you have the contents in the dispenser, you want to put your finger on the hole underneath and just push this button a couple of times to kind of prime it so that everything will come out smoothly. And that's just about all there is to it. Every time you put new contents in, you'll want to do the same thing of priming it so that all the contents can flow nice and easy.